You're a gay. Speaking of place, Corey's, Corey's holding a mirror. Huh? A mirror? I read Uruguay. Oh. You're ah! you're you you're a gay. That's what you. That's how you actually say Uruguay. Welcome to the biggest World Cup show you'll ever check out. The World Cup is on, baby. Canada versus Croatia. Yelling, you know, yelling grandma. You know how them Croatians get. They'll they'll give you a head kick. Yeah, they will. Snap one on you. Snap. Teesh. Snap, crackle, pop. Teesh. Croatia is coming after you. That's where uh, Croatian Crow Cop. <laughs> I think that's where he's from. I'm going to double check to double check. I wish I... Uh, I wish I worked from home so I could just watch the World Cup every day. Aw. Yeah, I know. You know what? People. I know if, even if you make less than me and you work from home, fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, you're just, just at home, doing whatever the hell you want. Well, I'm still working. Fuck off. Well, it's, you know, I got the kids and I still got to work. It's like, you're in pajamas. Yeah, you're in pajamas, dude. Like Bill Burr said in the half hour special in 2003, you're in pajamas. He said that? I don't know. One of his early things, he said, uh, he was saying that, like, oh, the it's mom. not much of a job yeah. <laughs> if you're in pajamas. Yeah. yeah. And uh, that's being a mother. That's even less. Oh, that was wild. That Dude, was, that first was our one. first goal. That was sick. That's Canada, too. Yeah. Canada nice. got some. Canada somehow dug up a ton of black people. For their team, yeah, they find it, found them all. Yeah, a uh, bunch of French Frenchies. Voulez pour ou te chamano ou le cato ou le vomes. I just I find the French language so romantic. Omelette du omato chamano mane romage. I that translates to I will lick your pussy. I will lick oh your pussy. Oh my god, <laughs> just because you said it that way, I'll I will you. lick your pussy like cheese, omelette du fromage pussy. <laughs> oh, that was so annoying. Oh, that man. goal just now was like what f- happens in FIFA. Was that the first Croatian goal? That was the second, second one. That was the second one. The, that the Canadian, one dude slide tackles the ball away, then somehow it just gets right back to the Croatian guy, and then another Canada guy tackles the ball away, and then it bounces off another Canada guy and goes right back to the Croatian guy, and then he shoots it. And I was like, yeah, that's what happens to me in FIFA. I'll tackle the ball away, and then the ball's like... It just gets back. It happens to be a perfect pass to a douchebag in the other team. Yeah, it just gets right back on the other team. And I'm like, does that happen to me? But see, right now, I I have to stop complaining because it just happened in real life. That's real life. I get mad at Madden, and then in the NFL, a ball does hit off a helmet, bounce off six other guys' faces... And then just keeps fluttering in the air until someone catches it. Yeah. But, the ball's anti gravity. But that happens in Madden every like two games. Oh, yeah. And I'm like, what may happen to Madden that I hated was su- gonna die. Was super linebackers. Just. <laughs> yeah. Anzalone. Yeah. Real life can jump so high, but in Madden, he's LeBron. Lebr- LeBron James. He's, he's prime LeBron. Dude, uh, speaking of LeBron James, I saw it was a uh, clip from some. Podcast. Podcast. It was uh, at WNBA, and she was like, she goes, like, the guy was like, oh, yeah, so, like, talking about how you guys should get, oh, like, paid more or whatever, and then she goes, yeah, all people do is show the differences or the, the, the amounts that we make versus NBA players. She's like, obviously, I don't think I should get paid as much as LeBron James. Yeah. And I didn't know this, what she said, what I'm about to say next. I didn't know this was the problem. Yeah. But I guess... Like, the NBA players, like, because their player association's, like, so good, gets them, like, percentages of all, like, jersey sales and all the stuff the owner's making, all that shit. And then WA, WNBA gets that none of those players get any percentages of any of that. Huh. I was like, oh, well, that's fucking bullshit. Yeah. So they should be making more money. These fucking, yeah. like, skeevy owners are just like, no, we keep everything. Because she said something like, yeah, if my sh- if my jersey is in- gets sold and we're out, she, like, just listed a place. And she goes, I don't see a dime from that. And I was like, that's fucked up. 
That's just because they're all getting pregnant at some point and leaving and getting paid for that. So that's, Yeah, you know, we got to pay for your maternity leave, bitch. And that's a Diesel, joke. you look that's disgusting. <laughs> you look like an amoeba right now. Yeah. How are you? Yeah, where's that other leg coming from? <laughs> Dude, your bot. Oh, man. That's funny. So, yeah. America. America. Dude, people are like talking. I was on the phone. There's been a bunch of upsets already. Yeah, sorry. What? I was uh, talking about about soccer on the bu- or the World Cup or whatever. And they're like, oh, yeah, men's plays. The men's team plays England today. Blah, blah, blah. And then they're then they're like, or the guy, and then uh, this one guy was like, oh, it's, or uh, USA plays England today. They said that, and then the guy was like, "It's men's, right?" And then the other person was like, "Yes, yeah, it's, it's men's." And then he's like, "The wo- the women's teams like really good." And like, the women's teams probably beat our men's team. And I was like, "And although our women's team is very good, yeah. that's not gonna happen." <laughs> no. But it does feel like soccer is more even of a sport than you know. If it was like the NFL or maybe even NBA, oh yeah, I mean, for some I'm reason sure it feels more even. It is, yeah, but maybe I it's because everyone's allowed to just fall in the ground. The women might win just because they're not flopping. Yeah, <laughs> they they go they go through a play and fucking score a oh, goddamn yeah. goal. I feel like if dudes did play women, they would be like, "Oh, we're not flopping against them," and they would yeah, just yeah, like probably. power through all the yeah. plays and you run right. faster. You're and right. They body. for sure would yeah. be knowledgeable of it. And be yeah, because like, they're like, yeah. "Well, I'm not going to be a pussy against yeah. a, if a woman kicks my shin. Nothing's happening." That would be funny though. Let's have like some of these Argentina, Argentina, like some of these Brazil, Brazil, some of these countries, have some of them play, you know, American women, <laughs> and and if they if someone flops, the refs just start red card and just start yeah. taking guys off the field. You got a pussy card. Uh, yeah, they just have a pink card. Yeah, pink card. You're a bitch. Your pink card. You got breast cancer. You now. cut your cack off. He's like, you licking your nipples, Betty. <laughs> He's like, what? Someone talk about my nips? Did everyone give thanks? Did everyone have good meals out there in the streets? That's fine. Thanksgiving overall is a shit meal. Is it? I mean, I think it's a shit meal if people aren't don't know what they're doing, and a lot of people don't know. I mean, even if you don't doing. know, even if you do know what you're doing. The ceiling for the food that's at Thanksgiving is not as high. I just as don't some believe so. I think you can season stuff. You can do. You can make food better. People yeah. just go, "Oh, we'll have boiled this," or just some plain bullshit. I've been, I've had seasoned fucking good stuff. I've had turkey that's been more seasoned. Yeah, but and then I go elsewhere. I don't care and how go, much what you is season this? a turkey. This is shit. You can season all meats, and turkey still. The best turkey is still not beating out the best all the other meats, in my opinion. Yeah, but you can also have chicken. People have chicken. Yeah, not, not where I go. That's chicken. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, They're but like chicken's, a, not, chicken's not I'm a traditional. I'm bitching about what people are doing. Chicken's not a traditional Thanksgiving thing, though. It, it, dude, black people and a bunch of other people do it. Well. Like, like there's a lot of people. Okay, but I'm not, even in America, they do it. Yeah, but you I'm, can't just like, I'm yeah, just but you opening, can do whatever you want. But Thanksgiving is still like the traditional meal. I'm just saying the traditional foods at Thanksgiving is still not as good as going to a barbecue in the summer and having fucking. I'm trying to open eyes to all the fucking people hosting Thanksgivings. You can do more, actually. You don't have to go, let's have this boring yam. Let's have this like boring whatever the fuck that red shit is that I never eat. Is that yams? I don't know what things are. Cranberries. Cranberries. There's or like the some boring cranberries or whatever. I don't know. I don't know. There's always like some boring shit. The, dude, there's just plain yeah, ass mac and cheese. Trash, you can man. have good oh, mac and cheese. I wish. It. I've never been to one where there's mac and cheese. Oh, I've always had mac and cheese. That's that, so that so when you say, keep saying tradition, that's what I traditionally think. I've had I mean, that since I, I was a kid. Yeah, I've never had mac and cheese. And then anymore. we've had seasoned, so we don't have the boring mashed potatoes. We got stuff with like, I don't know, they have some sort of seasoning in mashed potatoes, and then it's b- super buttered. And then if you wanted to, you could fucking throw gravy on every day. Well, gravy thing. makes it all better. If gravy wasn't there, I would eat none of it. Um. So my Thanksgiving this time, uh, dude, so I've always had good stuffing. I was actually just telling somebody, I like stuffing a lot. Because 
where I've had it at my family's, it's always been good. Yeah. And then and I go, we go somewhere else. And uh, when you get jets, you get square. Uh-huh. Uh, we go there. And we didn't go to jets. That's an old episode. But the stuffing dude was like slop. Ugh. I don't even really like even, stuffing. Well, that's what I'm saying. If you had the right one. Because I, I didn't think I did either. And then somewhere along the way, like a different family member brought stuffing. Because they were probably thinking the same thing. They don't know what they're doing with stuffing for eight years. Yeah. I'm bringing the right stuffing. And then it was great. Jordan had a vegetarian stuffing, like one that wasn't cooked in a turkey. Mm-hmm. I had one cooked in the turkey. I was like, oh, it's probably going to be great. And it was just mush. Yeah, that's a It was bad. Soggy. And that's not what, I mean, the whole thing was like slime. Yeah. And then uh, I didn't know till afterwards, we're driving home. She's like, oh, hey, uh, my stuffing was great. <laughs> I'm like, oh, good. Yeah, I've never been, I've tried all kinds of stuffings. I've never really been a fan. I don't know, but I'm weird. I don't like a lot of stuff. Yeah. <clears throat> I just want to take everyone. I just, the, you know, walk into a random home. Try out someone else's Thanksgiving. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I just, I mean, I like, I'll eat it. I just like it. Like the gravy and stuff's good. I put gravy on everything. Like what, has your, so, have you ever had like good desserts? Because there's oh yeah, usually, are good. there's usually but stuff t- too that I, I haven't had before someone brings. I'm like. I didn't even know this was a thing. Yeah. But then, they're like, I don't give a fuck about pecan pie or some of these other pies. Yeah, I don't but like pecan pie. Like, Sean's pumpkin pie like apple, is badass. I like apple pie and pumpkin pie. And, like, a, apple I'll have, like, pie. a chocolate, yes. like, a, like, a nice chocolate cream pie thing. Those are good. Yeah. Other than that, I'm not a huge pie guy. Like, Dude, cherry pie pe- sucks, blueberry pie sucks. Uh yeah, I don't like pecan pie. But I'm not I don't really like pecans that much. See the thing is like all those fruits, it's like they're fine, but I don't want an entire pie dedicated to that fruit. No. <laughs> I'm just like a sugared version and of I, that fruit with crust. Yeah. And I'm sure if you liked one, it was maybe one that's just pumped with every other thing into it. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Like I, I don't know. Like super glazed top. Like I don't I'm not a huge cherry guy, so I'll never eat a cherry pie. Like I've had blueberry pie and it's fine. Like everything's fine, but I'm like, I don't really care it's for fine. it. But like give me an apple pie, dude. It's give fine. me fucking apple pie, it's amazing. Give me pumpkin pie with some whipped cream and I'm eating that. Yeah. Well, they just uh they had uh D butt, Darius Butler on Pat McAfee's show. D and he was just naming like a bunch of other things that a bunch of the whites on the show were like, Wait, what? Yeah. <laughs> and then he's like, Yeah, well, yeah. you guys we, yeah, we've been having people, this since black fucking people 80s. Black or whatever. people do it better than that. It's like, you can have different things. You can have this. You can have that. I wish. And then we all go, no, we have to have the most plain uh, fucking, fucking everything. Turkey, We're all afraid of a little bit of a season. Turkey is shit. Turkey is fine. I'm sorry. I don't mean to offend anybody. But it's just every other meat. Even if like I had a really good turkey, I'd still be like... I'd still rather have, and then just fucking, I don't know. I, I had, uh, I was, uh, my one time my uncle did at Christmas, he did a prime rib, and I was like, this is fucking sick. Oh, yeah. No, so I've, how yeah. was that, see, that was the case where it looked like it was just completely out by Canada, but now they get to kick it. I don't know. I the guy watching. laid on the ball as I it was out watching. of bounds. <laughs> Like, are there weird calls by the ref where they're like, oh, we could have called a penalty on you, but we'll just say it's out on you. <laughs> he just fell on the ball. That, this guy right here, Easton Stick. Easton, Easton. Yeah, this is episode 100 million six. 100 million and six. Might be one oh six. Let's let's count them all. One, one, two, three, four, five. They're physically, <coughs> dude. The Sorry. fucking lions covered me and Jizz. They covered Corey. 
They almost fucking pulled it out, dude. Did you see the game? Did you even know what I'm talking about? Yeah. I saw the, uh, <clears throat> I pretty much saw the whole second half for the most part. Nice. I missed. I missed the beginning, but who needs to see the beginning? Dude, they're in the game. Oh. Off his face. In the face. Oh, oh. what are you doing? Oh, man. You should have retrieved that with his tits and just popped it in. It's as easy as that. Oh! Over here in Cutter. Wow. That would have been an e- that would have been quite the equalizer. <laughs> Whoa, went right over that dominatrix guy. Yeah. Skimmed his head, dude. There's a guy on the field right now in full leather. Just a hole for his mouth. Yeah. That's, that's crazy. Off. Yo, fucked up. Um <gasps> Uh, dude, I know. I just I wanted to bring up how fucking the lines. I mean, there's that's so many. Good, dude. Immediately, there's people on Twitter that's on that's on the coaching. Like how they like lost in like the last like two plays, they fucked yeah. up, whatever. And I'm like, well, they're yeah. in just entirely even having a chance <coughs> in the game because yeah. of coaching. Um, uh, I mean, I would say, I mean, definitely the third and one is. Coaching it was the coaching thing. Yeah. But the last play, they played the play. They had everybody back. They just defenders fucking didn't guard him. No, and then they had, I think they had one guy man to man, and that's, you can't, it's too hard to yeah, say. I mean, they had safeties and back, had, but he like, he went right underneath. I mean, if it's he just got that there easy. one millisecond before he, because his hand, it was like literally the ball was like this, flew by his hand. What, talking about he, Stefan Diggs. Yeah, 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 but if he would have got there, if the defender would have got there, because he came flying in from, like, out of screen and almost swatted the ball away on that yeah. huge pass down the field. Yeah. So I'm like, if that happens, then we're not talking about this right now. Yeah. So it's not like, coaching, they failed at every... It's like, okay, I mean, yeah, but also, like you said, coaching kept us in the fucking game. Dude, so many times it's third and whatever, or even on fourth down, it's like you have Jared Goff at quarterback, which the entire league is like, yeah... Yeah, he should be traded for, like, nothing. Yeah. And then... Uh, yeah, then he's just doing better than a lot of the... Then fucking, he's doing better than, a, like, half the league, kind of. Yeah. If you look around the league... Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. Oh, my, boy, shit. My pussy, fuck. Oh. Omelette du fromage. Ew, ew. Nobody's there. This yeah. guy's over here going, I missed it. I didn't know we were playing. What? Oh, no. My pussy. Did everyone stop playing? There's right. two guys like, let's go. They just lose the ball immediately? Soccer sucks, dude. Soccer gain you. Oh, my God. Drew just sent us a Stav tweet that says, they need to invent AirPods that can suck your dick. <laughs> he's not even making a joke anymore. Yeah. <laughs> he's, he's got so many jokes where he's get, always said that. that. Yeah, and yeah. then he's just like... Th- that's like his thing. He's just less words. He's just like, oh, they should do this. It sucks you off. Yeah. Dude, James Robinson, running back on the Jets, traded from the Jags. Yeah. Healthy and active. Jesus Christ. See, the stuff like that happens to running backs, and then the whole league's like, oh, they're not good. Yeah. And that's why they get traded for whatever. So they get traded for nickels and dimes. Uh, something's wrong with my ear. Nobody knows about that. Diesel. <laughs> That's funny. Okay, I'm showing Corey visual things. Visual uh, audio pod. Visual effects. So the lions almost. Honestly, cause I was even talking to people at work. I feel like it's a general, like consensus about like. I mean, that was a good game. Yeah. No. No. It wasn't like the lions fucked up. We had it and we fucked it. No. I mean, we we fucking were playing against a team where everyone's like, they're gonna win the Super Bowl. Yeah. So they're one of the best teams in the NFL, and we fucking At it was a game the whole time. They're winning in like yeah. the fourth, right? Yeah, and it wasn't like mistake after mistake. It was like, I mean, not at be- all. It was just the better team won. And then I saw um, quotes from teams around the league that people have been like, "Yeah, playing Dan, playing Dan, this Dan Campbell Lions is a uh, is a tough game. Like, n- no, no one's 
everyone's yeah, like, been talking. Like people aren't looking into it, going, "Oh, this is this is like the lines yeah. you roll over." Yeah, I think now teams are going to come to Detroit and be like, "Don't fucking look it, at their record, okay?" Yeah, a bunch of them are saying like <clears throat> they're just playing way more physical. Yeah, and and that's the same type of shit right now that you're hearing with like uh, Michigan, uh, like Michigan finally beating Ohio State yeah. two times in a row. They're just saying like they're just playing way more physical, and I'm sure like Ohio State was in it for a good chunk of the game, but then at some point they're just getting your ass, they're getting whooped. tired, yeah, and like f- like the big guys and everyone is just getting manhandled, yeah. And then you got little young baby J.J. McCarthy. And he's like, I could, like, I could throw a way down there where the guy's wide open Papa several Harper? times. I'm going to throw the ball. <laughs> you think uh, I could do it? Good job, son. Don't have an abortion. Yeah, don't. <laughs> if you're going to have, if you're fucking have that baby. That joke is because John Harbaugh spoke at a pro-abortion. Yeah. Oh! Uh-oh. Yo. Oh, what a save. Big. Yark, yark, can- yark. What's yark. the Canadian music? <clears throat> What's the Canadian music? Oh, oh syrup yeah. is good, syrup and is there's good. mooses and elks and mounties, we and we say thank you and elks. Tim Hortons. I just did it. Oh, Tim Hortons, we have coffee and a few donuts. Yeah. Oh, Whoa, I just got deeped. Oh, double gacked. <laughs> lock, 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 lock. Trade gacked. Diesel. Sometimes you get two women. Sometimes you get you. diesel gacked. <laughs> Look at him over there. Hey, you got a a dog around? Just put some peanut butter on yourself. Hey, remember, remember get we dog a, gacked. Remember we had a friends giving and nobody cared. Oh yeah, we had uh, three people here. Good thing you changed it so I could go. I was one of the only people here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, uh, and yeah, and yeah, Drew. Drew and Mim kind of went yeah. Friday. It's like Jordan will tell me about. Oh, I think we're going to do this. And then I'm looking at her because I'm not in any chats she's in. Yeah, yeah. And she'll be like, I think. She'll literally come up to me and go, I think. Like, she'll be like, this person's a yes, this person's a yes. And then I think this yeah. person's going. And then I'm like, well, I talked to that person and they can't go. <laughs> <laughs> so oh, she'll be like, I think Drew and Mim can come. And you're like, well, Drew already told me he can't We're go. making food for two people? Yeah. And then... <gasps> Let's go Canada. Oh, oh. Canada. Try your hardest. I don't know if people like the do people like us. Yeah, let's go. Well, I like listening to it. Bill Burr when he, he just will, will do a yeah. podcast sometimes Sunday with yeah, football, football on. on. It's great. This is him. Look at this fucking yeah, guy. My da- man, my daughter, man. She's growing up, man. She uh she's riding her first. Like, what kind of fucking play was that? <laughs> you gotta be fucking kidding me. And then yeah. I'm like, <laughs> yeah. Wait, the, the third and 20, and we're going to do a check down. Yeah. Or whatever. I don't know. He bitches a lot about prevent defense, which is exactly the kind of thing that happened. Like, I'm sure if he watched that Lions game, yeah. he was he was bitching about the Stefan Diggs getting that <laughs> a tampon in his nose. What the fuck? <laughs> Literally, fun? a guy in Canada has a tampon in yeah. his nose. And there's no joke. There's no joke? I'm yeah. not exaggerating. A dude. There's a tampon in his Canada. nose. Right there, number 13, Canada. Google it. It'll pop up on Twitter. Canada tampon. and You'll get it. Canada tampon. They call me can tamp, can tamp. I like the fucking dominatrix guy. Yeah. I like to have him throw me around. Yeah. Yeah. Saying you're going to throw people around is, is yeah. a cool thing, you know? <laughs> I'd like to have her. Is she, like an, is she like a bigger woman that's attractive? I'd like to have her throw me around. Uh-oh, you know? what does Drew want? Wouldn't that be fun? Oh. So Bill Burr for sure would have bitched about that Stefan Diggs. But the reason, like, I just, I want him to be on the Pat McAfee show or just some show and have people talk That's about. Right, it's just, they, they come, you go, we don't want to get beat deep for a touchdown. <gasps> but also they don't want a field goal either. But yeah. they're trying. Yeah. The defense is trying. They're just. They're backing up. They don't want to blitz, and then someone is an easy. Then that's an easy like quick pass. A guy yeah. gets twenty yards if they send too many. So like they can only send four. Maybe they can send one guy blitzing. Yeah. Or sometimes some teams do one less, which is what he's seeing, where only three are going in on the quarterback, and then you got eight guys dropping back, and they try to have some sort of zone. But in today's NFL, I mean these. 
receivers can just you can pocket in in the zone and just make a good tough catch. Like guys collapse in on you, but Stefan Diggs, some of these top guys, just they can make a catch. Mm. Well, why don't they do that all game? Well, it's just like a. Uh, they can they can send more. There's different situations. Yeah. Because like, there's different situations, you know, like how far they're going to go. You can blitz. I don't know. Whatever. I don't know. Uber's not even here for me to tell. Can't so. even tell him. He's not here. Wow. What a piece of shit. He didn't answer my text. He didn't. Uh, we contacted his agent. He said, how many listeners? And we're like, we're like, we're like we got, there's like a, some, really. sometimes there's a hundred. Yeah. Really just pretend that you, nobody's listening. Then that's probably accurate. Yeah. The rain. It's a rain phone. Oh, Ooh, he got megged. He got megged. Oh, and then he tripped him because he got megged. You made me look like a bitch. And he tripped him. Made me look like a little bitch. Make me look like a bitch. Bia, bia. Dude. Oh, yeah. I, I got to reset. I got to remove, reset my. Po- what are these? They're so cool. Little poof dogs. The little uh, leather poofs. Leather gay guys. Leather. I'm a leather daddy. I'm a leather daddy. Leather daddy. I'm a leather daddy gay guy. Leather daddy, I'm gay. I'm a leather daddy. I'm a leather daddy. I'm, I'm a gay. leather daddy I'm gay. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. I wear leather. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. I'm gay. Oh, shit. I wear leather. I'm oh, gay. fuck. Somebody rape me. Hey. Yeah. Speaking of rape. Yeah, you want, to, you want to hang out later? Um, what? You want to go to the bar? Speaking of rape. Speaking of date rape. Speaking of date rape. <laughs> you want to go out? <laughs> that's uh, not good. That ain't. That's that's something that we shouldn't do. We shouldn't do that. It's not a good thing to do, guys. Don't do it. See, this podcast is for good. Yeah, man. This is why we're pro-abortion because of bad people that do rapes. <laughs> Also, there's 8 billion people on the earth. Confirmed yeah. November 15th, yeah. 8 billion people. Was it confirmed? Yeah. Who confirmed it? Whoever confirmed One guy. that stat. He's like, I counted them. <laughs> I did it. I went. It took me my entire life. I'm yeah. 78. <laughs> They're like, well, isn't there more people in certain areas? And he's like, oh, oh no. God, I didn't even factor that. <laughs> oh. oh, my God. I did go to a big NFL game on one Monday. <laughs> oh, and then I went to a what? soccer game on a Tuesday. Not even thinking like, oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. That's good. I can't believe I did that. Dude, uh. I traveled building to building. I didn't think that someone could be in one building working, and then the next building they could be shopping. Yeah. I might have counted somebody twice. That's how you get 8 billion. Oh, this guy's going. Do you ever go to, uh... Look at this. I hate... Ah, uh, it sucks. Do you ever go to parties, and then someone has, like, their little baby there, and then I, uh-huh. and then you go... And you're sitting there, and you just go, why couldn't I bring my dog? I don't understand how it's any different than... <laughs> We were at Jen's family, and there was, like, a bunch of babies. Really? And, like, a few of them were crying randomly. And I just looked at Jen, and I go, my son cries all the time. I, why can't I bring him? What the fuck? Yeah. <laughs> uh, was dude, there a house w- already with an animal? Yeah. See, that's weird. Sometimes I Honestly, see... Honestly, that's the only reason why we probably couldn't bring him, because the dog that's there is, like, super old, and they can't help themselves but trying to play with each other. And, yeah. like... She, like, just doesn't want to play with him anymore because she's like, I'm super old. But, like, I don't know. So yeah. Jen's like, no, we don't bring him. But, Ooh. dude, her cousin fucking was there with who has five kids, dude. Two oh, of yeah. them are with a different guy. But then. I've heard about this. Yeah. But it's funny because the guy, her, ar- heard about this? her OG husband was with her that day. So he, like, walks in and shows up. And then I just was like. That day. There's just a different one every now and then. I mean, she's, like, engaged to another guy. Dude, it's weird, and I don't get it. But he walked in, and I go, oh, okay, so this is, like, I don't know what's happening. And then we all, like, we're in the garage, like, me and Jen and, like, her sister and a bunch of people. Yeah. Not the the, uh, people I'm talking about, but. And then I just go, I just randomly was like, this might be a stupid question, but, um. 
where's that other guy? Yeah. And then everyone just like starts laughing. Oh, really? He's yeah. In <laughs> yeah. And then like, Jen, well, then after I left, Jen said one of her aunts, like after the, the uh, her cousin and her cousin's like husband and all their million kids left. Yeah. Jen goes, one of her aunts just goes, does she like think we're all stupid? Like, I don't. Because yeah. she's like with another guy. But then she brings him as like the father of all of her kids. But two of her kids are from like a different guy. And then the one guy that was there referred to her himself as daddy to one of the kids. That's what the other guy. Oh Dude, it's fucked Lord. up, bro. Yeah. I mean, Jen, Jen well, I mean, we talk about it all the time. We're like, uh, this, how this, are these real people? I know. This is what I'm saying, man. When I, when people talk about things in the news and they go, can't be real. I go, I don't know. Because, like, I'm pretty close to a I situation say, that's I say that up. about everything. I know. <laughs> but I'm pretty, it's like, I'm pretty close to a situation yeah. that's actually fucked up. And I'm like, it, it's real. <laughs> uh, well, the one situation that's not really similar, <clears throat> but in a way of divorce is. Can? Can. None of them are Canadian. Yeah, okay. <laughs> yeah, what the fuck? <laughs> we Guys. Love, we love Canada. <laughs> <laughs> My cousin has a convenience store there. I, I'm for sure in Canada. My cousin works at Tim Hortons in Canada. I'm 100% Canadian. Yeah. My cousin moved to Canada. He becomes citizen and works at Tim Hortons. Dude, um, every Tim Hortons I've been at where it's not like American, like kind of like looking people, it's the best Tim Hortons I've been to. Oh yeah, because they work. <laughs> they fucking go. You know, we're taking advantage of this cool opportunity we have over yeah. here. Uh, life, life is nice. Like we like this situation. We're we're here. Yeah. Or whatever. Like they might even be first, second, third immigrant, but they're just like, this is better. Yeah. And uh, it's actually not hard to make a sausage, egg, and cheese sandwich wrap. Yeah. And when someone says old fashioned glazed donut, we don't give them a fucking plain donut. Yeah. <laughs> we give them we give them what they are. <laughs> uh oh. Uh yeah. I like think about that stuff, but then I'm like, I think about our country right now and how all those jobs pay shit and you can't really. I know. I literally go back and forth "Ah." all day. Yeah. I go, "Ah." well, it sucks. And then I go to the next one where they're all Asian and they're all kicking ass. They're all happy and in good mood. Hey, have a great day, dude. And I'm like, oh my God. Yeah. Oh, it can be run like like this. The the problem is like, okay, um, I walked into Kroger yesterday and it just, they have a gigantic sign and it says, now hiring up. Two fifteen, fifteen fifty, up to, up to, up to. So you're not maybe you won't even get that. Yeah, you're not gonna get over that though. Yeah, yeah. And I'm like, and then but like these people argue, yeah, but these jobs are for kids, and it's like, okay, so you want a bunch of kids to just run an entire Kroger? <laughs> yeah, you want kids just are fucking retarded. <laughs> Have you ever talked to a kid yeah. who's 18? Yeah. They don't care about anything. Yeah, they want a child to run their uh yeah, their Tim Hortons. Yeah. And it's they like, have that job. None of them want to be up at 5 a.m. Yeah. when I need coffee on my way to work. Right. <laughs> they have that job because most of their parents are like, you gotta get a job. You gotta get something. They don't wanna work. They don't even have to work. They they're it's like most of them aren't paying rent. They have maybe a cell phone to pay for. Yeah, this is my little And they're just like, oh, this is just for extra money. So and I don't my, really care. And yeah, my little sisters are doing it to like Maybe get like a PlayStation yeah. or <clears throat> or to buy a PC. Could you imagine though, like if the job you had now, if you really didn't need it, and if you got fired, you went ah whatever. You wouldn't. You would go there and go. Ah, I don't care, Chris. I need you to do this. Ah, I'll do it when I get to it. You, I will fire you. Fine. That's fine. I'm making thirteen ten. Yeah, exactly. So like, what the fuck? You all these jobs are for those people. Okay, well then you're yeah. gonna have the worst service for the re- yeah. But then those are the same people that are gonna go to a Taco Bell. They fucked up my order. Well, you said it was for kids, and that's all that's in there is eighteen year olds. So, yeah. <laughs> uh, you can't. Yeah. You know, we saw, uh, we saw um, Indian men in- <laughs> cheering for Canada. Are we talking about yeah. fast food or something? Yeah, we got on fast just food. Funny. I just I just liked the trajectory. Of everything, yeah. I just I reminded me of the because I did have that thought when I walked into Kroger's and it was a gigantic yeah. blue sign. Now yeah. hiring up to fifteen fifty. And, and they, I, ha- they have I that just, at the fast I, food places. When too. I read that, I just I keyed in on up two. So it's yeah. like probably like eleven though. Yeah. Okay. Twelve, and it's like like fifteen fifty. What if you're a manager? So if you're fucking manager, I think then is the only time it goes more. Yeah, probably. And that's what the the people that are that you would be arguing with because I I talked to a guy at work about it. Uh, he would say, 
Well, no, you have like a manager or two, and the, yeah. they'll, they'll make twenty or whatever. And yeah, it's but twenty's like, not a lot either. I know. <clears throat> and then, and then my point to him is that I'm like, we're in a warehouse right now where there's people making twenty, and there's they're fucking mad and stressed and overworked and pissed. Yeah. at twenty, and you're gonna give someone managing people, and you want to have somebody, yeah, managing teenage idiots, uh, yeah, who are just fucking up, who are who who call off and miss because they don't care, yeah. they don't need it. There's sixteen. <clears throat> you constructed a world where everyone who works is 16. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, you want it to work well, and then you're mad. They didn't put the tomatoes on. <laughs> Fucking Robbie didn't 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 didn't, f- didn't rotate produce. Or they didn't fillet the fish. What do they do there? Rotate the coolers? Yeah. Push up, push forward. Push forward. See, Chris used to be there making $9, 7 or something. I don't know. Literally. <laughs> yeah, I was making 15, f- or I was making 515 when <laughs> okay. I started in 2005. Yeah, dude. Pushing carts. Yeah. And they were like, well, look who you're pushing carts with. And I was like, well, you can't say that. Yeah, you can't and say that. And then they go, well, look at these few guys. We want them. You want them to pay. And I'm like, they're getting paid like $3. Yeah. <laughs> they're like slaves to yeah. you guys. <laughs> this is crazy. Yeah. And then, uh, uh, yeah, then I moved to grocery, and they're like, all right, well, now you make 740 And I'm like, that's minimum wage now. And yeah. they're like, yep. Yeah, yeah and we're going to hire a bunch of people at the same rate. Oh, you've been here for five years? Yeah, dude. Yeah, they, they, they did that's get me. Up. I think I did well, I did get to 1050 maybe, I think. I finally left. And then you went over to the Woodhaven. And then I was at the Woodhaven stamping plant making. Oh, yeah, even there they were like, yeah, we're, we're gonna have you making sixteen, and then it what? I think it wasn't at first. Oh, no way! Man, that sucks. Yeah, Canada's in a hole now. Croatia on top. Krokop just kicked that boy Mil- in. Miracle Krokop. I like to see Krokop play soccer. <laughs> He's just fucking breaking people's legs, doing yeah tie kick. kicks to everybody. Chris, you see that tie kick? He's head kicking people. Yeah. <laughs> that guy's wearing a bra. This guy's got six red cards. No one can get him off the field. <laughs> it just keeps kicking the refs. <laughs> How much money is it costing people that are like to go to the World Cup? Ugh, that made me mad. I get mad. I know d- people are trying. Dude, you got magged. I know people are trying, but I just get mad because I just have played defense and. I don't know. They're like afraid. They don't want to have a deflection go to the net. And it's like, you got to just fucking kick that thing. You got to hit. Uh, he thought he did, but it's too quick. <laughs> ooh, 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 ooh. Look at all these. Look at how athletic these guys are. These guys are just specimens. Specimens that I would like to fuck. I'd like to see the <clears throat> semen of these specimens. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, we'd all like that, yeah. wouldn't we? Yeah. In a perfect world. Yeah. Woo! Just get another, oh. just get another one. Oh. Oh, nuts! The fuck's going? What, what the hell? Oh, yeah, yeah. I did. My arm, my arm hit him. This is that how creation stuck? <laughs> my arm. No, they they talk like at least Crow Cop was like. Is Crow Cop Croatian? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, he'd be like. He talked very soft yeah. and quiet. What a pussy. Not like that. I'm, I'm, he talked like one of the, the scary Russians. They don't have a lot to say. Oh, yeah. That's what, he, that's what he talked like. I mean, these guys are all little bitch sluts. Yeah. You know? Because the soccer people, of any people, are just like the, you know, most bitch people, you know? So. Yeah. What? Yeah. You're talking about my sport. Why? It's a. I'm why? Gonna, why? What'd you say? Why? Did they still do that? Yeah. I heard uh, uh, on Tuesdays, I think it was like the most recent one, yeah. Joe did. Okay, pep. Yeah, he did. Yeah. And I went, okay, pep. Yeah, my dreams have come true. Dreams have come to life. Even though it's not as good as the first time I heard him do it, because he did it like twice in a row. He's like, okay, pep. Okay, pep. Okay, 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 he like did it okay, twice. Pep. And I was like, oh, this is what I want to hear. Yeah, and then he did it on that one, uh, uh, you, you know what, dude, pod. Yeah. And then everyone's like, oh, what are you fucking... What do they call him? Oh, yeah. Uh, Miller? What the hell is that guy's name? Ronnie Miller. Ronnie Roderick Roderick. Some, well, that's the guy some that, older co- comedian. The guy that just showed. They were showing him. Uh, they were doing a little pre, 
game thing, and they were like, Pre-gick? it was like his mom. Pre-jick? His mom was like, my son's going to the World Cup. Like she was all, happy. oh yeah, so. I can't believe it. Uh, dude, talking about the World Cup stuff, didn't uh, what the fuck was it? Yeah, some people were paying like. 800 bucks for like the worst. I thought I saw something like that. Oh my God. It's so crazy. Like, not like them T Swift tickets, though, dude. Well, some oh. of those were like 150. Taylor Swift. Yeah, because yeah. I, I know. I just saw like one where people. it was like 10,000. And I was like, what? yeah. Then I'm sure that's uh, some scalping bullshit. Yeah, scalping bullshit. Yeah. I mean, that's what I thought of immediately, but I was still like, Jesus. And they're like, it's worth it. No, it's not. Well, if ten thousand dollars is like what dude. five dollars is to me, then yeah, I guess it's worth it. But yeah, dude. Um, so she was telling me who she's bringing on tour. Taylor Swift was telling yeah, you that. Yeah, Taylor Swift was telling me. <laughs> <laughs> she it was. Te- I was. Te- I te- I DM'd her and she uh, replied. She went. I'll tell you, Chris. I will tell <gasps> you, boy. Oh, God, we wanted you got to capitalize. Come back. Capitalize. Look. Whatever country's closer to you, that's who you're rooting for. Canada's closer to us. We want them to come back. I just think it'd be cool, man. Because uh, in, 20, oh, in 2026, so it's being hosted like here, here. And in Canada and Mexico. Let's build it up. We got to build it up. Mexico team's great. Besides Mexico, who cares about them? Yeah, they've had enough success. No, they're not going to win. We'll bash them. They'll bash their skulls in. Oh, Canada. Look at that. Well. Oh. They're down. They're, They're down. Mor- Morocco, Belgium, and Croatia. Tough battle. Yeah. Sorry, what? Taylor Swift is from what? She's bringing she bringing She DM'd tour. me, yeah. and <laughs> that guy looks like a little baby. <laughs> but I love the idea of flopping in your own, like, defensive yeah, side. You're like, yeah, nobody, we'll just be down one. <laughs> yeah, nobody, yeah, nobody's done Yeah, it. we'll just be down one. The ref doesn't call it. Yeah, I'd like to be down one on defense. It's all good. <laughs> Did you see that? He got it. Then he moved his body the other way. Yeah. He was going the other way. And then he flip-flopped. Taylor Swift told you about. She DM'd me. So they have. she's bringing different acts yeah. to different uh, cities and all this shit. And one of them, she's got Haim. Yeah. And I was like, dude, I would like this to go. Yeah. Is Haim's cool? Uh, yeah, I think it was Haim and Paramore to some like one one of the cities. I was like, oh, wow. or maybe a couple of cities. I was like, what the fuck? I was like, that's actually great. Yeah. I would fuck. I'd spend a couple hundred j- just like one time. It's kind of cool to see all three of those bands. I th- I like them all. I know. Uh, I don't know. I want to do them all. So you're going? Maybe I'll do them all. Maybe they'll fuck me. The one's DMing me. No. So, um. So you're going? Nah, but and then <laughs> she looks up the Detroit one. Yeah. And of course, that's shit. It's like to uh, because I thought since I heard of Haim and Paramore, and then she named some other places, and it was all like female artists, and I was like, see, this is what I was been saying. Uh, like she's getting so she's being consistently like lifted up. I'm like, wouldn't it be cool though to like? I know she. I've heard of some nice things she's done, but like, yeah. bring her her acts that she's bringing with her, like the openers and shit. They should all be like fucking awesome. Pump up some more female Harm's artists. Way. Harm's way. Yeah. Uh, bring Dying Wish. They got a female oh front and singer. Bring back Bloodline Calligraphy. The Ypsilanti, Michigan uh, hardcore band from the 2000s. From the aughts. Yeah. Um, but, yeah, the Detroit one was like two male acts. She, like, named one. One of them I looked up. I was like, oh, uh-huh. this little guy looks horrible. <laughs> I was all, like, what yeah. the fuck, dude? Are, all, are any of the girls going to this? Yeah, uh... So they have different groups, our uh, our lady friends. There's a group that have, like didn't want to spend too much. Yeah, and they I think they all spent like around one fifty. Oh, so ticket. all of them are going? I think I don't know. There's some uh, of them are. like I know Mim Jordan. They're they're in the cheaper group. Oh, so they all they. And then oh, there's okay. a group that's I didn't even like know anyone was going. Yeah, then there's a group that they're like we'll spend for five hundred or whatever. Oh wow. I don't know. Maybe it was over two or three. I don't know what it is, but. There was two different. They split up uh, up into different groups, which makes sense. At first, I was like, "Someone's trying to buy tickets together, right?" Because yeah, <laughs> just, just go two over here, two over there, two over here. Yeah, it's kind of be. It's kind of suck, but I, you know, Taylor Swift, dude. 
Uh-oh. That's the money maker. So, Corey, what do you got going on? Dude, Croatia! Oh, no. Wow. I can't believe they didn't get that. Sheesh. Yeah, that's crazy. That guy's that guy nuts. Ooh, look at that little skill move. That was sick. Pop it out there. Yeah, let's go. This guy's like, I'm tired, actually. <laughs> oh! Uh. God damn it, dude. I hate it. They have to have better plays than that shit. God damn. Tungsten. What? Tungsten carbide? Tungsten carbide. Tungsten steel. Oh, did you play the new God of War? A little bit. A little bit. Is it cool so far? It's pretty cool. Seems very familiar. It's like the last one, but I have nice. not played it too much. That goalie is, although he's been scored on three times, he's insane. I was trying to see. <gasps> Sorry. What are you trying to see? Your own pee-pee? I'm looking for my wiener. Looking oh, okay. So she's bringing Phoebe Bridgers. People love that. Oh. Gracie Abrams. Uh, you know, they're doing the that in Tennessee, one? Philly. Oh. Uh, you know, they keep going. Where's she? Uh, where's Detroit she one's pl- in fucking June. Where's she playing at? LCS. Oh, uh, or else yeah. with girl in red LCA. and Owen. That's the Chicago and Detroit. Oh, uh, okay. Girl in red and Owen. Where yeah, she? I think the Owen guy. I looked him up. I was like, "What the fuck is this?" Is she playing at Little Caesars Arena? Tickets are uh, five hundred to a thousand. Right here. <clears throat> I I think I don't know. That's crazy. Oh, Ford Field. Oh, Ford. Oh, oh, okay. Damn, dog. I can't imagine. I've never been to like a like a a concert of that scale. Oh, well, I was that we we did go to. Uh, I was gonna go to see Rage Against the Machine and Run the Jewels. Uh, and yeah. where was that? Another band. Oh, uh, that was gonna be LCA. Oh, okay. Little Caesars Arena, and then that got canceled. COVID started. So they were like, yeah. we'll prolong it. And then they're like, oh, COVID's not getting better. Prolong it again. And then they're like, oh, actually, we're coming back. And we're going to start doing shows. But Michigan's going to be in like a year and a half. Yeah. And then they started doing shows. I'm hearing great things about the shows. Yeah. I'm hearing that they're, I don't know, that they had, like, oh, that uh, I see like, some of these TikToks. And, yeah, and then he's like, oh, I hurt my shoulder, and so we're just going to never, ever play again. Yeah. Here's all, Everyone get your money back. That's, and that's it was kind of cool getting 200 and something dollars back. Yeah. <laughs> Like in my, for my card, and then I was just like, nice, I could pay pay this off. Nice. Now I could fucking buy my bitch. Now I could buy my bitch wife a new poof thing that we put her feet on sometimes. <laughs> Dude, that was so funny yesterday. Uh, when they buy were, a basket the, that we don't When they were use. talking about bed. like a room or whatever, your own game room. Yeah. And it seemed like they were like trying to like defend her. Like, they did. I mean, what does he like need it? They and go. Isn't this a game room? <laughs> I'm like, yeah, just because you put something on a TV doesn't mean like, oh, okay. Yeah, but she has this room, and then she has that room. And she, she's yeah. like, well, I read over there sometimes. And yeah, I, read. I, read, well, I do my makeup in one room. Yeah. Then I go to a whole nother room. I need a whole nother room for books and reading. Yeah. And then, then there's a room where he thinks it's his game room, but it's actually... Me going, um, you're being loud. Yeah. Room. Yeah. <laughs> Where I go, and then I just look at her and go, you could be in any other place. Yeah. In the house. And I'm not even enclosed. She, like, like, oh, I'm being loud? Oh, it's because I don't have an enclosed room to be in. Yeah. You know, every man nowadays needs a goddamn... Well, we did, a they, room. They did the, we did an area. Yeah. It's like, people got a shed. <laughs> Or like a fucking garage. Yeah, dude. Um, I did a nice garage, is, though, man. If you fucking I know. It is funny up. to think about Bill Burr, and then he's reduced to a garage. Oh, yeah. Because he's, like, talked about, like, that's where he likes to be or whatever. I'm like, he's Bill Burr. <laughs> he doesn't even have a fucking actual room. Actual room? <clears throat> he's Bill. He's Bill goddamn fucking he's Burr. Fucking Billy Burr. I like when those comedians are like, I remember him when he was Billy Burr. Back in the day, he was good old Billy Burr. 
Does that happen? Yeah. It's, he literally went on stage for like years as Billy Burr. That's hilarious. He was a little redheaded dude. <laughs> a little like orange looking fuck. That's funny. <laughs> I'm an orange fuck. It's funny how sometimes he reads emails on his podcast and sometimes he, you know, people start with insults because that's just what he does. He's like, yeah, uh, oh, goodbye, go fuck yourself. Or whatever. Uh, and uh, people will email him in and sometimes he's like a kind of aggressive. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, oh me! See, people always talk about I got floppy tits, and then, he, but also, you know, he's trying to fill an hour or a half hour if it's the Thursday pod. <clears throat> yeah, I know I got a. Uh, I know I got mad at a guy recently who was like, he like brought up, yeah, I like read some comments on a thing, and they were like saying this thing about you, and then he was like, you know, I don't have a problem with you till right there. Well, like, yeah. that's, you know, why would you tell me stuff like that yeah. or whatever? Like, yeah, those are the people that are, like, shitty. Like, who, if someone, te- so-and-so said this about you, you're worse than them. I hate in soccer <laughs> that it's okay. So that dude, he flopped onto the ball and yeah. grabs it and resets it. It's like, why is that allowed all the time? Yeah. Well, he's got a yellow card, so. Yeah, if he, he got a yellow card because he continued doing dumb things. Yeah. But first off, fuck you. You First off, you flopped onto the ball, and then you're like, I can reset it because you clearly fouled me. Yeah. It's like you, you make up the rules. <laughs> you, know, you don't make the rules. Nobody called anything yet. You just decided, oh, I'll just reset the ball. You hit me. <clears throat> and that's World oh, Cup. Oh, God. That's World Cup football. There he is. There's the mass. This is a real man. Canadian football. The mass sexy man. Yeah, sub five guys in. I thought you only get three subs. Or internationally, you get like four or five. Uh, they had four guys up there waiting. I think you can do more, but I'm not sure. Maybe four. Wow. It's three reg- in like BPL, right? Yeah. Ugh. All right, yeah. I got to go to a little kid party and buy a race car shirt or something. A <laughs> race car shirt. Yeah, it says uh, the party's too fast. Should be called Too Fast Too Furious, and then we just watch all those movies. What are, what are all these? Uh, what are all these themes? I don't know. Can't you just have a party? I really, I think you should have no theme until your kid's like eight. Yeah, your kid should just be left in a kennel until he's eight, and then then he's more of like a real person. Yeah, like these parties are for like for you though. Well, no, how old is this kid? He's probably old two. enough to remember. It's two. Yeah, he's like, old. Too fast too. Oh, that's nice. Too fast. Yeah. Is it too fast, too furious? Uh, that's what I'm saying. We should be watching. I mean, that was an easy one. They could have just fucking done, and they didn't do it. And have The Rock holding a baby? Yeah. Well, The Rock wasn't in that one, but yeah. Vin Diesel. Rock is in none of them? No, he's not in the Too Fast, Too Furious. Oh. That's the second one. Vin Diesel's not I just, in that one. When I hear that, I think of all of them. Oh, well, yeah. <laughs> you could have just done that then. Yeah, have Vin Diesel Paul holding a baby. Paul Walker. Ty- Paul Walker and Tyrese were in that one. Tyrese, dude. What a sexual being. Yeah. What a sexy man. He's a sexy man that I want to have sex with. I'm gay and I'm a sexy man that's gay. Okay. We're getting overloaded here. Ah! Hey, that thing.